Yeah. Hey guys, from Pearl here, back with another video. Welcome back to Golden Warfare, guys. Now, um, we're finally playing the last plant character. I know I play the plants so much more, like, every single day. It's only because I prefer the plant side, because they're short of the light, and the zombies are kind of the darkness, if we're going to be honest. And, um, yeah, I customized the rose, because... I'm gonna be straight forward, uh, straight honest here with you guys. I feel the rose lacks in detail. I just feel like it's one of the most undetailed characters in the game. So I gave her this. These hand flowers, this awesome staff. Now I'm not too crazy about uh, witches, liches, and uh, you know, all that. But here is the character, and if I may say so myself, she looks pretty beautiful with the flower um, around her. <laughs> around her head and also the nice staff and I love the glove uh, not the gloves <laughs> the glasses the rosy glasses whatever call it what you like we're playing as the rose today but she's all about magic and that's the exact thing I don't like like especially in movies I don't like black magic I don't like that due to obvious reasons I believe as a Christian like I I don't want to get involved in magic stuff but um we're not instantly gonna go to multiplayer we're gonna go meet Rux in the sewers, as usual, so I'll catch you guys there. Go to Listic. Boom! I missed it! I actually missed it! Yeah! <laughs> Suck it. <laughs> okay, we're almost there. I just decided to cut back in because I wanted to turn the guy into a goat, but it didn't work. <laughs> My magic spells aren't very good. And th that's just the thing, you see, I believe that if it's not from Jesus or God, then what power are you using? That's that's the only thing I feel like that's weird. Having trouble making a decision? No, not really. I know what I want. I want the... Or... Orcane Louts. I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right. Or... Orcane Louts. Or... Or Sin Louts. <laughs> but when anyway, what it does is a rose ability, and it looks pretty cool. The rose alters her magic slightly, transforming into a being of pure invulnerability. <laughs> Healing energy. Wow. Now look at all the stats. We're gonna... Oh, I want to buy them so badly. But as you can see, I pretty much only have money for literally one. And since we're playing the rose, we're gonna buy Archin... Ar Arkin Louts. I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right. I'm really sorry, guys. But that that's the weirdest pronunciation thing I've ever seen in my life. So we're gonna zoop the rose over all the way to Colonel Korn's missions, as usual. We're gonna open up the rose portal pretty soon, which I think is gonna be really cool. And we're soon, really soon, we're gonna enter the realm of the gnomes. Can I turn you into a goat this time? Yes! It is a goat. Kill it! Kill it with the rose petals! There we go. <laughs> Ridiculous magic though. And I know it's just a game, most people will say that, but I take it seriously. Like, I don't know, if, is it Sherlock Holmes? No. Yeah, I think it's Sherlock Holmes, but when I watch the movie, well, I didn't even watch the whole thing due to the problem, which was in the beginning there was already black magic and I, I don't like it. I don't feel comfortable with it and I don't feel it's anything God would ever have anything to do with or Jesus or so, you know. So we've already done the Citron portal, so that's pretty cool. I'm gonna go straight into the crop fields. <laughs> the corny crop. The corny cobs. Bleh. <laughs> and I know I'm talking a lot, I should have just started here, but whatever. So here's Colonel Corn, or correction, Agent Corn, whatever. <laughs> Agent Corn, you made it back. Outstanding. Good job, soldier. Now take this cob. Okay, let's do this. Agent, uh, I read his name again. We know, uh, we now know the enemy's plants. The plants. <laughs> I almost said plants. Actually, I did say plants. And they are big. They're planning to ship the world's largest bottle Bottle, am I reading that correct? Bottle of nuke juice back to the Z-Tech headquarters. Oh, great. You heard me, nuke juice. But we have, uh, we have plans of our own. Of course we do. I hope. I think so. You must steal the shipment of the nuke juice and protect it until we can extract you and uh, the cargo. Oh, great. It's going to be one of these missions. Move out. Affirmative. Negatory. Affirmative. Leave quest. Black husk down. Okay. 
Oh, we're doing it right here. Quick, get to the delivery area. <laughs> uh, how hard could it be? Is the usual question I ask myself. Until I realize there are a horde of zombies all around. <laughs> so without a doubt, guys, I prefer the plant side. I just don't like her. I feel, I feel she looks much better with customizations, guys. If you get the rose, there's the transport balloon. <laughs> okay. I feel like if you get the chance to customize the rose, do it. She's hideous without it. I feel like her weapon's also quite inaccurate. Very inaccurate. Like, even if I am aiming right and I have the right mouse sensitivity settings. Okay, I'm gonna just turn into that. I don't even know what that's called. Oh, I won't let you take it. Zombies, destroy that nuke juice. Oh, what? Are you crazy? You'll kill yourself. But you're kind of already dead, so that's besides the point. <laughs> I haven't played with the Rose at all, so I probably don't have <laughs> that good experience with her. But either way, oh no, of course there's a toxic scientist, why wouldn't there be? And I missed the shot again. <laughs> this is actually quite difficult. Ah, suck my throny pellets. <laughs> Airstrike inbound. Lure those zombies to the flare. What flare? Don't worry, these won't hurt you. Yeah, I, I figured. I hope. Otherwise kind of besides the point. Okay, the nuke juice is taking a little bit of damage. What does it say? Mushroom flare. Flavor. Oh no. It's even got a flavor. That's ridiculous. Okay, um, defeat the nuke juice. Ah, oh, defend the nuke juice. <laughs> Another one incoming. Lord of the zombies. They're attacking the nuke juice. They're not like in interested at all. What? You need to hit him directly in the face to even turn him into a goat. That's ridiculous. Okay, that's it. Suck some of this. Boom! Boom! Sorry, kid. Out of ammo. But help is coming. Uh, please. Hurry. There's a, uh, ooh. Oh, no, there is literally help. Okay. Sweet. I'm only doing nine critical damage, and I'm dead. <laughs> Darn you, Gigantor. Ugh, juggernaut. I don't even know what his name is. Gigantor Juggernaut. Juggernaut Gigantor. There. Can I even turn this thing into a goat? That'd be so hilarious. <laughs> nope. It didn't even do damage. It's useless. I'm a... Oh no! <laughs> it was about to say something and I died. <laughs> so, I have no experience with the rose whatsoever. I'm gonna be straightforward. It's my least favorite character. Uh, my... <laughs> Where's my words? She's my least favorite character in a way. Okay, quest complete. That was not a very good quest, I'll be honest. Like, it's funny, but it's not that great. Okay, so, how much quests does it leave us with? Probably just one. I just wanna see. It's about time you showed up. Yeah, that leaves us with one. The other one's just a reward, which means we'll be moving on to the rose pretty soon. And I also see there's different icons for different characters. So I'm actually pretty, pretty excited. Uh, now we're gonna try out some multiplayer matches as usual with the events and everything going on So we're gonna try that out straight away. Okay, here we go again. We're defending um, I hope we'll get, we can do one more round where we're attacking. Stop the zombies from creating the castle oh, This is really convenient. We're playing as the Rose and it's the Rose Castle. Okay, never mind The alien flower got that one and we got a Disco Chomper. Now I hear that the Disco Chomper is kind of a letdown in a way but I haven't placed my professional opinion on that yet. Not that it is professional, I'm just saying my opinion. So I can't actually say if the character's bad or good. Um, but everybody's got their own opinion on what works for them and what doesn't. So the best way to know is just to play this game yourself and then figure it out from there. Boom, you're a goat. You're not going anywhere. <laughs> That's kind of an hilarious ability. But it got triggered though. Okay, I got him. In the back. That's a nasty move. Right in the back. Ugh. Okay. Let's try a time snare. Ah. Now let's try and get up close. Okay, the scientist, he totally spotted me. Oh, look, two imps. Okay, I got I got the one. Oh, the all-star. The all-star saw me there. He saw me there. I don't feel like she's range tactic, guys. I feel like she's more a support character. You're there to help your teammates. Like, unless you get an upgrade, you can become a bit more punishy. Um, 
but I feel like she's more support. Like, she freezes characters, she can deal damage, and she can turn them into goats. So I'm going to go with more of a support character. So, you're there to support your team. You also make teleporters, so I would definitely put her on the engineer side. She's thus just there to support. She can deal punishment, depending on what rows and what tactics you use. But otherwise, you're, oh, level 3. As you can see, I haven't played with her a lot at all. She was only on level 2. <laughs> okay, I got that guy. There's an imp over there. The imp knows I'm, I'm coming. Okay, I, I can't do anything to him. He's in his mech. <laughs> Little imps. Oh, I actually hit him. I somehow hit him. I don't think this guy, this guy might be new because, yeah, I think he's new. Oh no! Oh, how low was he? How low was he? Oh, it didn't show. <laughs> Archim. Yeah, Archim's pretty good. He got 15 kills the last round. He was um, top performance for all vanquish van vanquishes. Blech. <laughs> don't judge me, guys. It's hard to say that. But I feel like the Rose looks better this way. Comment down below uh, what you think about the Rose character. I professionally... Mm, so far it's pretty weird playing because I don't play a lot of this at all. So sorry for all you Rose fans that I just... If I hurt your feelings towards this. I'm just not crazy about magic stuff at all. I feel like it's, it's fishy. It gets dark real fast. Especially black magic. Don't ever get into that junk. Ooh. Okay, how much? How am I doing? Oh, I'm actually doing pretty good. I guess some of those were actually support kills, but yeah, whatever. Okay, let's get out of here. Oh no, what? Let me guess. Oh no, it's Jezeprin. Jez... Jezepro. Je Jezepro. I, I don't know, it's got a Z in it. Jezebipro. 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 No, I, I can't. <laughs> I can't say it. Mm. It's always so funny when you try pronouncing other people's names, or like during a live stream that somebody like tries pronouncing my name, and it's like, oh, hey, pull, You know, they like first have to say it a couple of times before they actually catch it. The Rose's jump, I think, can help her a lot. In a way, I feel like her jump's actually excellent. It's like a, it's a brilliant strategy for if you want to like jump. I feel it works. Like just that little jump boost. I feel like it, 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 it benefits you. I've only got five for health. Um, I'm gonna get back, get back, get back. Ooh, I, sorry. I thought I could go, but I wasn't checking my health. Fuzzle, five, five, five. Fuzzle, fifty-five. I like that. Fuzzle. And guys, if you want to befriend me on Garden Warfare, or just want to chat to me or whatever, um, my name is Purple Pod. <laughs> P Purple Pod, yeah. You know, like, if you know what a P Pod is, you'll know, like, from the Garden... Uh, the Plants vs. Zombies mod from Minecraft. My inspiration was again from there. A lot of my stuff are inspiration from Minecraft. I'm an old, died, hard Minecraft fan. If you uh, guys actually want to see Minecraft come back on my channel, I'll actually do that. Oh, I didn't hit him. I thought I could actually reach him. The bullet kind of drops though. Ooh, these guys are nailing me. Uh, Stefan. Yeah, I, I just need to read Stefan. I don't read. Oh, look at this guy. He's got like futuristic look. They look great with the future P, the plasma P. I kind of wish they kept the future P. Like, I don't know if you guys saw the old skin for him. I get that people said it was a little bit too robotic, but it looked cool. You gotta admit on that, it did look cool. But it wasn't very planty though, yeah. But to be fair, they added the T-800 cactus. You know, Terminator cactus. I honestly need to get more used to this character. But we are holding this point, so I'll give us credit for that. But I need to get her some upgrades. She doesn't have any upgrades. Not a health upgrade, not a T- not a ta- not a tiny bit. Oh, my bullet was blocked there. Yeah, I need to try out this heal thing next. I feel like it's gonna be handy. Okay, somebody got him way before me. Oh, it's the pea shooter. 
They're firing from there, man. I only hit him once. I gotta time these bullets just right. Time snare, come on. Oh, there's a soldier all the way over there. I also got hit by a fire soldier of some sort. At least I turned a couple of them into... Oh, goats. <laughs> oh, no, there's, there's breakfast brawn over there. And there's a guy over here. All start, look up. He's most likely going to throw that bomb. That would have been the perfect moment if he had it. Whoa, what, what happened there? I, like, boosted forward. Oh, no. I thought he got him. I thought he got him. <laughs> but no. Okay. But we defended the point. I think we're going to get, like, full support <coughs> or something. I'm not too sure. Um, hello. That was odd. Okay. Let's see what the scores are. <laughs> I just want to see this. And we'll do one more round. Hopefully we're in Vegas this time. 21. Wow, that's good. Okay, I'll give it to that guy. The Citrons are actually pretty powerful, surprisingly. I still struggle with that character a tiny bit. Uh. But I'll get there. So, catch you guys in the next round. Okay, so we're defending again. That's okay. <laughs> Whoa, Electric Cactus. Sweet. Okay, I'm gonna try and stay close range this time, guys. Because as you can clearly see, the Rose is more of a support character. Stay near friends, trust me. Well, I just don't know how to play as the Rose, but I am getting better <laughs> at the moment. I, I haven't played it as her a lot, so I can't say that I have any perks or anything, so... Oh, there's a parrot. Bullseye. There's another parrot. You need to sort of curve the bullets. It's illy timed. I think I got both of them. No, there's sunflower shot as well, but I did get points for that. Okay, sweet. I got the imp. Obviously, she'll be a perfect imp repellent. <laughs> Oh, someone's got toxic. Do you think it's um, what's it, what's his name? I'm gonna put on that healing whatever thing. I've got the name already. No, I missed the bullet. No. I think we can take this breakfast brains, dude. Uh oh, engineer. He's running. He must be on low health. He must be. Ah, now it's the whole world, bro, no? Oops. I'm gonna, I'm gonna toggle mute just so that you guys don't have to hear that the whole time. Like, no offense to the player. It's just, it's very loud. And I can't sit it softer. I've already tried. Whoa, look at... The alien flower looks so cool, but I hear they all got debuffs. I just wish, come on. And the winner is the sunflower. Which created an alien spaceship with a frozen zombie inside? Okay. <laughs> There's also one that looks like SpongeBob, but a log. I like it. It's like lumber log. Lumberjack log. And then somebody did an ice block first place. <laughs> what? Wait, what? No, no, what does it say? Winner. But how is that first place and that's winner? How? I don't know. See the bu bullets, even though I'm standing still, they don't go straight. So I feel like more like a close quarters combat character. Oh no, he died. Nice job, Colonel Horn. Oh no, I didn't see the bot. I didn't see the bot. Mm. Guys, this is really hard. I need to level up this character so I can get some health. I need to get health upgrades. In fact, I need to check does she even have any customizations, abilities. Okay, let's try the arc. <laughs> oh boy, Blah. the arc, archin, arcane. I I can't literally not pronounce this. Lots archin. It's probably a type of flower, but this is going to heal my friends, which I feel is gonna be a better aid to the team. So this is really cool. I won't be dealing damage, but I will be invincible for the period of time, and I will be healing people around. Oh, this is not going well. Oof. 
I may not like uh, whatever his name is, Brains, Toxic Brains, but um, he is a very powerful character, I have to admit on that. I just don't like him. I, I'm not a big zombie fan, okay? I never have been. I don't like Walking Dead, Left 4 Dead. I've never enjoyed them. I'm just not that kind of person. <laughs> don't check me. Yeah. Thorns from above and from beyond. Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. I figured. Oh. Guys, this is really hard to pr I must said pray. I always do that. Play as the rose. It's really hard. And I haven't played Golden Warfare in a while. I haven't played with her a lot. But as you can see, the healing ability actually heals more than the Sunflower. Which I'm completely impressed. The Sunflower only heals two and there's no upgrade to help you along. So I'm giving credit to the Rose for that. The Rose has got better healing than the Sunflower. That's amazing. And this scientist is kicking butt. He's been on a quite a few servers, I believe. I'm sorry if there's noise outside like dogs barking. I can't keep them quiet. I can't keep them dogs quiet. Oh, I actually got him, somehow. I'm gonna try and heal this buddy. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh! What was it? It was a parrot. No. <laughs> I feel like I'm really struggling with this Rose character. Mm, boy. Breakfast Bronze is on his way again. Oh, just about missed him. This looks really cool, though. No! I thought I was going to get the engineer. How low was he? 47. Not even close. Whoa. Is it the inaccuracy of the weapon? or I'm confused with the Rose character, guys. If you have any helpful tips that you want to give me, uh, do. Because I'm sorry, I'm kind of like downgrading the Rose character. I just... It's not because just because she's magic and everything. It's just... I really don't know how to play this character at all. Okay, that was a good move there. I'm gonna try and get away. See, I'm healing more than the sunflower. I'm amazing. I'm gonna get this toxic brain. I'm gonna have to. Otherwise, he's gonna start terrorizing us. See, the bullet drops. You gotta know how to use these perks, otherwise, you're pretty much dead. My favorite so far is the time snap, without a doubt. I'm not gonna let you get close to me. Oh my word! Is he on diamond? No, he's on gold tier. He looks ugly. I have to be honest <laughs> with that character. And I'm sorry for background noises, as usual. Oh, 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 the scientist's coming up. Oh, we actually do have an aimer. That's that's very odd. I can aim with my wand. I'll, I'll point at things really hard. <laughs> uh, oh, no, I wasted the time snare there. I feel like she looks cooler in that mode than she does in her original. Oh. Let's see, um... Oh, I actually got three kills. <laughs> so clearly, the Rose is not my strongest point, and that's why I've been avoiding her. I am pretty good with the Chomper, though, and the Pea Shooter. My two favorites, and the Sunflower. I love the Sunflower character. I don't know about you guys, but it is an awesome character to me. It's my favorite. Plus, it's original. Oh, no. These scientists put a punish on the Rose. I'll be straightforward. But the Rose character probably gets more powerful as she get, gets upgraded. I will do more future videos on her, since I'm not doing too well with her right now. Clearly need some more practice. Uh, magic thistles. Thistles. Oh, yeah, thistles and thorns. That reminds me of that saying in the Bible. What does it go like? Um... Yo, I forgot! I need to go read that chapter again, but, uh, y'all, the Bible talks about thistles and thorns. You guys should go re uh, read it. It's, it's pretty good for your soul. Trust me. 
Oh man. Oh, I'm actually doing some damage here. Oh no, but there's a, there's a dead beard. I'm not taking that chance. It's a fire dead beard too. But he just is it the flame dead beard? No. There are two different dead beards. The one looks like the same, but he deals punch damage, like he's a tank version of it. I forgot what it was called. I, I think it might be that, because otherwise it would have been set on fire. <laughs> the pirate imp. I must be honest, I like the look of the pirate imp. It looks like fun. In fact, I never said the imp character doesn't look like fun. I just said I didn't like the imp. <laughs> Even though he's the original character. It's just because he's overpowered and he's annoying. We can't seem to hit this darn parrot. Oh my word! The parrot's got insane tactics. It's dodging everything. See, the scientist is taking me out of one hit. One hit. Oh no, we're down to the last point. Defend the mirror to stop the zombies. I must be honest, I was a huge fan of the game when it came out. Um, my sister introduced it to me first, and I was just like, wow, this game is rad. To think my sister, of all people, found the game first, and she doesn't even, like, she's not a very TV, computer, or any of those kind of people, but yet she, she's the one that found the game. <laughs> and then she's like, hey, Look at this! And I'm like, wow, that's amazing. It's plants versus zombies. Who could have thought of such a genius idea? And to think it started off as a simple game like that. But I do still enjoy the old things nonetheless. And now it's this game today. It started off something simple and became something huge. That just shows you, don't be afraid to try anything out. You can't touch me. But I can't touch it. So I'm gonna... Ah! You're not going anywhere. Yes. Revenge. Revenge. Uh oh, I see him. Oh, he wasn't aiming for me though. What? What was that? No, somebody shot the potato. Yes, I got him into a goat. <laughs> no, no, this guy. Also, what I noticed about this guy is I don't know if it's an ability. But when he shoots me, it disables my abilities. Sort of like a stun for like three seconds. But it's just enough to get me killed though, because I can't turn into my um, healing form or whatever. Akron. Akron Louts. I don't know what it's called. Archon Louts. Is it Orchid perhaps? Uh, no. I don't know what to say, guys. It's just. I can't read it. I literally can't. Okay, I got someone. Oh. And then I turned someone into a goat, and then this guy got me again. This guy's good, he's got me seven times, I've got him three times. There's ice, the ice is melting, stop there zombies! He looks so chilled about it, like there's nothing happening. Kinda wish they added more emotes for him, his character's kinda uh, getting old, like, with each and every speech. Oh no, I turned him to a goat! I turned them both to a goat! So if they're really near, can I turn them all into goats? Wow! But then he killed me with a stump, it's unbelievable. So diamond tier characters are really painful to play against, man. Could I just get the rose some upgrades, please? Okay, turn someone into a goat again. No, I was about to use my second ability. And this guy stunned me again. Oh my word. But that was good there. Eight kills. Okay, we got that's probably our highest record as the rose so far. That's good. I bet some of them are assists, but the fact that I can even get some amazes me right now, because I'm not doing too well with the character. <laughs> that guy got thrown across the screen. <laughs> uh, Yeti King is up. No. Okay, guys, um, that's going to have to be it for the rose. I'm sorry that it was... Or wasn't that great? I'm just not really the best of the rows. I, I haven't played with it at all, as I said. Whoa, they dominated us. Um, but I will see you guys in the next video. We'll do a rose video again. Next time, I promise I'll do better. But until next time.